basic strategy. Oh, that's why. Alright guys, we just need to do some stuff, be right back. Alright guys, we're back. Sorry about the arrow there. Just went out and fixed some arrows, or not arrows, but fixed myself a bottled fairy. And that's it. Lost some arrows along the way. And... That's it. Nothing more. Uh, just going to do a save state here. Let's see. Yeah, let's let's do this. And so, for the sake of it, you never know. So right. I don't want to have to go through that again. Is that you? Yes, that's you. Come on, I hate these games. It sucks. What is that you? It seems like you. It wasn't you. That's you. So now we have to... Oh crap. It takes a whole heart! Fuck! I hate volleyball. Come on. 
game. Any of the other games, actually. He needs to die. Probably not. Avoid it. Mm hmm. She can shoot. Come on. I want to take a hint and die. Right, he's dead. Successful. Yeah, you did quite well. Looks like you may be gaining some slight skill. But you have defeated only my phantom. When you fight the real me, it won't be so easy. And the worthless creation that goes to us, I will banish it to the gap between the mansions. So, after many problems and many breaks, we have actually gotten the heart container and we will get the disc. She appears. Thank you. Because of you, I could awaken as a sage. I am Saria, the sage of the forest temple. I always believed that you would come because I know you. No. You don't have to explain it to me. Because it is destiny that you and I can't live in the same world. I will stay here as the forest sage and help you. Now, please take this medallion. The fourth medallion. Sorry, awakens as a sage and adds her powers to yours. Saria will always be your friend. Oh, isn't that cute? <laughs> Crap. Oh, and they drop us off by the Deku tree, where it has begun to be a sprout. Hello. What is this magic? What is this sorcery? <gasps> oh my god. Something grew out of the ground. Hi there. I'm the Decatree Sprout. Because you and Saria broke the curse on the forest temple, I can grow and flourish. Thanks a lot. Well, Mr. Sprout, you're well welcome. Hey, have you seen your old friends? None of them recognize you with your grown body today. That's because the Kokori never grow up, even after seven years. There's your kids. You must be wondering why only you have grown up. Well, as you might have already guessed, you are not a Kokori. <gasps> you're actually a Helian. No, the conspiracy. I am happy to finally reveal this secret to you. Mm -hmm. 
Some time ago, before the king of Hyrule unified this country, there was a fierce war in our world. Alright. One day, to escape from the fires of the war, a Hylian mother and her baby boy entered this forbidden forest. The mother was gravely injured. Her only choice was to entrust the child to the deck tree, the guardian spirit of the forest. The deck tree could sense that this was a child of destiny, whose fate would affect the entire world. So we took him into the forest. After the mother passed away, the baby was raised as a kokori, and now, finally, the day of destiny has come. You are a Hylian, and were always bound to leave this forest. And now, you have learned your own destiny, so you know what you must do. That's right, you must save the land of Hyrule. Now Link, break the curses on all the temples and return peace to Huru. Hi there, I'm the Decatrice Sprout. Because of you and Sai, I broke the curse on the fall. <laughs> Alright. You are very, 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 very welcome. Because you will be of great help some other day. When you have grown up to be a big dick of tree. Like your papa. Hmm, alright, let's see here. Where should we go now? I feel like I've known you for a long time, mister. Oh, so you do, do you? Saria's house. Well, we don't need to go into her house. We know where she is. A quarry shop. You can buy arrows at the shop only if you have a bow. Have you got one, mister? Yes, I do. Little miss. There's nothing here I need. I got everything. I only have six arrows left. Oh well. Not really sure where I should should go now. Actually, I do have a general idea what I should do now, actually. I should do the thing I didn't get to do before, but I wanted. Come on, horsey, ride! Should stay there. All right. So let's get down from here and into the city and to the Temple of Time. Here. The inn 
inside of the Temple of Time is quite nice. The outside, I couldn't care less about. Oh, she's waiting for me. You destroy the wicked creatures that haunted the temple and awaken the sage. But there are still other sages who need your help. In order to awaken all the other sages, you must become even more powerful. You must travel over mountains, underwater, and even through time. If you want to return to your original time, return the Master Sword to the pedestal of time. By doing this, you will travel back in time seven years. The time will come when you will have to return here quickly. I will teach this you for when the time comes. The song to return you to the Temple of Time, the Prelude of Light. Upside, upside, side up. So, right. You have learned the prelude of light. As long as you hold the Ocarina of Time and the Master Sword, you hold time itself in your hands. Link, we shall meet again. And off she goes. So. Is now we can actually go back and so we're a child again and the world is all nice and light This is actually exactly what we need. So I will begin to show you what we are going to do actually. Hi! Welcome to the Happy Mask Shop! We deal in masks that bring happiness to everyone. How would you like to be a happiness salesman? I lend you a mask, you sell the mask and bring the money back here. If you want to read the fine print, take a look at the sign right over there. After you sold all the masks, you will become happy yourself. Have faith. So yeah, we will borrow this mask. So as you see I got the first mask and what we're going to do in the next one, or rather the next time, uh, we're actually going to go around and fix so we get the last mask, mask, whatever. Because we want to have the mask of truth I believe it's called. And why do we want the mask of truth? So that we can see what the statues are saying 
for one thing and I believe there's another use for it but I can't remember it right now so yeah but that's it for this time guys so I will see you next time